Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a huge luxury haul for you. And just to clarify, I did not buy all of this all at once. This has been accumulated throughout the summer and some of these I got in early spring, but I just haven't had a chance to sit down and kind of share them with you because I've been so busy traveling and whatever. But we have a mix here of fragrance, some accessories, some really exciting tech, and then a massive fine jewelry haul from Cartier that I am so excited to share with you. I've already been wearing all these pieces and so I just wanted to finally sit down and talk about it with you. Now the first two items are from Charles and Keith and this video is very generously sponsored by Charles and Keith. I'm so excited to partner with them once again because they just have such a special place in my heart. Ever since I went on a mother-daughter trip with my mom, we traveled from the Philippines to Thailand by way of Singapore and at the Singapore Changi Airport was my first encounter with the Charles and Keith duty-free shop and I just fell in love with their sleek lines. I love the minimal designs and I just love the history of the brand. It started off as a single shoe store in Singapore and they've since expanded to bags and other accessories. They have I think over 600 brick and mortar stores all over the world and they are just so fashion forward. If you go through their website they have tons of editorial looks. You can definitely find your own style on there. They have very graciously offered another code for my viewers. If you use the code CKAHM15 at checkout you will save 15% off your order. They ship super fast. The first item I have is a bag and I love their sleek dust bag with this little satin ribbon. These are great for travel also as like a shoe dust bag. So this first bag is the Croc Embossed Crescent Hobo Bag. And I love the gold detailing here on the zipper pull. And then up here, you have this kind of a you know, cross lock. I love the style. I love the color. This comes in black also, but I really like this cognac brown. I think it goes well with my lipstick. I love like browns and bronzes for the fall. It's such a great fall bag. I love that the texture is this mock embossed croc. This can be worn in a couple different ways. So you can wear it as a handbag, just in your hand right like that. You can wear it under the crook of your arm. And this is really cool because as much as I appreciate handbags, this has a removable shoulder strap. So if you unhook this at the top, you can just add this kind of a shoulder extension. Just turn both locks like so. And now you have a nifty shoulder bag. So this is it here with the added shoulder strap. And so this is a perfect shoulder length on me, but because I'm pretty short, depending on your height, I actually can wear this as a crossbody bag. So this just kind of hits me right exactly at the hips where I prefer to wear a crossbody bag. So I just like that you have these multiple ways to wear it. It comes in multiple colors. I just think it's such a perfect transitional convertible bag to wear in the fall. I got these black metallic chain accent knee high boots and I just love the height. It's the perfect height. They are so soft, like the material is so soft. It's not super heavy or clunky. They're very light and comfortable to wear. The lining inside is so soft and breathable and then it's got this extra protection here underneath the zipper so that it's not going to catch your skin but I can definitely see myself wearing this with almost every single outfit. I pretty much live in boots throughout the fall and winter, especially down here in Georgia, it's always raining. And I love the perfect heel height. It's just a little bit of a lift, but it's still very comfortable so that I can wear this while I'm running after my kids. I use Charles and Keith pretty much every day. I wear my Charles and Keith crossbody bag when I'm walking my dog. I have a Charles and Keith wallet that I keep in my car, like all my gift cards and cash and coins and stuff. They're always coming up with new collections, new styles, new colors, and some of the stuff sells out quickly. So make sure you check out their website. Again, you can use my code CKAHM15 to save 15% off. And then next up, I have a bunch of stuff from Love Shack Fancy. They have been really killing it recently. They had a ton of collabs and a bunch of new products that I have been loving. So first, earlier in the summer, I got the Supergoop and Love Shack Fancy like travel set. Supergoop, like the SPF brand. They did a whole travel set with a, this really cute pouch. I've already brought it with me on my trips. They had the antioxidant body mist. It might still be available. If any of this stuff is available, I will link it below. But they had this. Okay, so we have the glow oil. It was just a bunch of stuff. It was so cute. Love the vibe, protect your skin at the same time. So I love Supergoop. I love their glow screen, the tinted glow screen. And so when they had this Love Shack Fancy collab, I just had to get the whole set. Love Shack Fancy also did a collab with Gap. And I got so many things from that collection, mostly activewear, and which I already showed like on my TikTok. It's already in my closet downstairs, so 
I'll just link everything that I got and a lot of it might not be available anymore. But what I did get recently that was out of stock and it came back in stock, so I signed up for notifications, but I got their trench coat. Oh, it's so cool. I, it still has the plastic. It has their signature little rose on there so you can pin it or you can remove it if you want it to be more minimal, but look how pretty. It even has their floral design lining and then it's got this little ruffle shoulder. It is so cute. I love it. I'm so glad I was able to get my hands on it. I got it in a size small and I probably should have sized down because it's kind of big. The arms are long, but you know, it's just the vibe. It has the belt so I can kind of cinch it up. So basically an oversized but very glam trench coat from Love Shack Fancy and Gap. And then their launch that I was most excited about, they finally came out with Beauty and they started off with the fragrances. So I got all three fragrances. We have the Love Shack Fancy Moon Dance, the Forever in Love, and then my favorite of the three, Boheme. This was the first one that I ordered just because I love blue, <laughs> so I had to get it. But as it turned out, this is my favorite of the three. So I started off with just <laughs> the discovery set this was only 15 dollars. this is at sephora so i ordered this and then i got this also because i just knew i wanted it for for the aesthetic and then the discovery set has all three but it tells you the notes on here so bohem has notes of peony black current white amber moon dance is velvet rose dreamwood and magnolia and then forever in love i think this is their most popular one in the pink bottle this has notes of green pear gardenia and cedarwood so they all have very strong floral notes obviously i just think this one is my favorite this is more like of a berry you know black currant the white moon dance is it's a little more like powdery i think and then this one is more of a fruity floral so i love all three i had to get all three these other two i got directly from the website if you use the code lsf 15 you'll save 15 percent off by the way when you order from their website you get a free pick of your fragrance so that's it. I just love the bottle. You got this bow topper. And apparently if you finish the bottle, you can open up the little spray, take it out and use this as a vase, <laughs> like a vase, like one single bloom, put a flower in there. So pretty. Even the boxes are pretty. I don't save every single box, but these are just so pretty. I don't know. Should I save them? What am I going to do with them? I have all the boxes. They also have a signature like floral tray. I'm debating whether to get the robe in this color, the blue. I just love their stuff. They also just came out with activewear. So I'm a Love Shack fancy stan now. I think the full size bottle retails for about two something, 225 maybe. So if you don't want to go for the full size, they do offer the travel size and I think it's like $30 or 32. And then they also just released the travel size set for all three. So I actually might pick that up even though I already have the little discovery set. So it's like the travel size version of the discovery set, the travel library. But yeah, very pretty. Definitely recommend if you love florals and if you love Love Shack Fancy. Okay, for all you tech fans out there, this is probably my most exciting unboxing ever. I got the most amazing package from Samsung. It was in this beautiful box that says, welcome to Galaxy. They reached out to me and offered to send this to me. <laughs> they gave me two choices, black or lavender. And as much as I love wearing black and most of my wardrobe is black for accessories and especially like tech accessories and anyth anything that can be lost in my purse, I like to choose brighter colors. So I chose lavender and I got this exciting box with a very thoughtful card from them. And in here we had a brand new Samsung. I already opened it, so this is it here. But they sent me a Galaxy S23 Ultra in lavender. Okay, how freaking amazing is this? I'm already using it, I love it. And then it gets better because over here, which I already opened, this had a Samsung Galaxy Watch 5. And then on this side, we had a pair of Galaxy Buds Pro 2, all in purple. How cute. I got the case in clear so that I can appreciate the lavender, but I love, love this phone. I've been using it every day. I haven't officially switched my service over to this yet. So for now, I've been just using it with my Wi Fi but I have it connected to my new Galaxy watch. So it's tracking all of my movement. And I love the purple Galaxy Buds Pro. They fit so well. 
and they're so comfortable and they're purple. I posted this to my Instagram stories and I mentioned that years ago I used to have the Galaxy Note. Do you guys remember that phone? It was huge. Like it was huge and it was my favorite. I loved how big the screen was. And one of my favorite parts is down here, you have the stylus that pops up and you can write notes on here. <laughs> and then it just saves. It's the coolest thing. This is the coolest phone. It came with like a little kickstand ring and I love the video and the camera on here. The pictures are so clear. The video quality is so good. I was initially looking into buying a new camera for YouTube, but I might be able to just film all my videos <laughs> with this phone. I'm so excited to have a Samsung phone again. And I also love how all my Samsung products can be connected. I think we are slowly turning into a Samsung only family because even when we moved into our new house here about a few years ago, we had to buy a new fridge and I immediately chose a Samsung fridge. I have a Samsung vacuum, like a stick upright vac that is so powerful. And I also recently found out that my Samsung stick vac has this like attachment where it cleans out the dustbin on its own, like a robot. You don't have to clean it out yourself. It's so amazing. Remember bag vacuums back in the day? I already thought I was upgrading with this new cordless stick vac, but then they have this other attachment that magically cleans out your vacuum. I just love it. Also our Samsung TV, like it's all connected to our washer dryer. So like when my washing machine cycle is done, that was another thing we had to buy. I bought a brand new washer dryer. I love it. It's in the champagne color, it's Samsung. And it plays this really nice song when it's done with the cycle. But then when it's done, it connects to my Samsung TV. So it lets me know that my laundry's done. Like how cool. It's just, I love it. I love that everything is connected and I can control it all from my Galaxy S23. And finally, what you have all been waiting for, my Cartier haul. So I'm going to have to go a little backwards here. I have three items to share with you and they are all right here. But first look how cute. I got this little baggie of chocolates, which I haven't opened up yet. She also included a little thing of fragrances. How cute. Oh, and of course, another dust bag with my name engraved on there. She gave me another jewelry kit. I actually have a stack of these now because again, these are three purchases that I made going back a little bit, but I got a new Cartier jewelry cleaning kit with every purchase. There it is. So let me go backwards from most recent because I've been waiting to share this with you so I could wear it. But here it is. We have this little tiny box. So just to give you a hint, it matches my Juste en Clue ring and my Juste en Clue small bracelet in gold. But we have here, I love the Cartier boxes. There it is. So this is the Juste en Clue earring, and this is the one that they sell just as a solitary earring. It's open here, so that's what it looks like. But when you close it, which I'm going to do when I put it in my ear, <laughs> because it's kind of hard to open up. This retails now for $9.60, and this they sell just as one earring. You can buy two if you want, but I purposely just got one because I plan on wearing this in my second earring, like hole, because I wanted to wear a diamond cuff on the other side. But this is it right there up close. You can see. So yeah, I plan on wearing it in this earring, like in between. I have three like ear piercings on my lower part of my ear and then I have one up here, but you can also wear it up here if you want. It's very pretty. Once you put this on, it is so hard to <laughs> take off. Okay, so I have it in my earring now. You have to be very careful because you don't want to bend the clasp, but once you snap it in place, you'll hear it click and then you know it's secure and then this like this sucker is not coming out you have to be very careful but i just think it's so pretty look at that you have a nail head in the front and that's it i wanted this because it's very comfortable to wear because again it's just basically like it's like a huggy like a little hoop huggy kind of like this one up here and so i can leave it in my ear without having to remove it all the time there's a larger size of the just on clue hoop earrings but they circle all the way around and then it just is like a regular I think, butterfly type closure at, in the back. I thought these would be a lot more comfortable to wear and I think it's so pretty. Now I have the matching set with my ring and my bracelet with the earring. And then these other two boxes are very exciting because it's my first two from this collection from Cartier. We have a necklace. This is the Clash de Cartier necklace and this is the small model and this is in technically it's rose gold but the rose gold is very pretty. It doesn't really look all that pink next to the yellow gold but it's 18 karat rose gold. 
I love the chain of this necklace, especially because it's very glittery. It almost is like a diamond effect, but it's just the cutout. It's like little cubes on the necklace and it's just very pretty. Also the back of this necklace has the Cartier logo kind of dangling down there. So let me show this. So here's the necklace on the lowest setting. It is so pretty. This reminds me of the Tiffany Smile collection, but what's so cool about the Clash is these little spikes, <laughs> they're loose. They actually kind of jiggle around a little bit and I just love how different this is. And finally, <laughs> I feel like you can probably guess what this last one is from the box, if you can tell. We have also from the Cartier Clash collection, the Clash de Cartier bracelet in the small model. There it is up close. The more I saw this in store, the more it just like intrigued me and I just had to try it. And once I tried it, I had to get it. <laughs> so here it is. And again, I have to do a whole review. I'll do a review comparing all the Cartier bracelets because at this point now I have the Clash de Cartier small. I have the Just Don't Clue and I have the small love bracelet, which I don't wear every day just because of the way the whole, you know, having to screw it on and off. But this I definitely wear every day. This I wear fairly regularly, but this is how you open it. So you open up this little top part, press down on this hinge, and then it unlocks. And there you go. The As far as the size, I have to double check, but I'm pretty sure I got the same size in the Clash as the small just to include. So I think these are both size 16. I know that with the Clash bracelet, it I think ran a little larger than the Love. So I actually took a size down. I think with the Clash de Cartier, these ran a little larger than the Love bracelet. So for these two, I took a size 16 versus the my small Love bracelet I have in a 17. But again, it's your preference. I definitely recommend you try out the bracelets and the sizes in the store. But look how pretty. See how it kind of jiggles around. I just love this style. I love how different it is. I love how like modern and edgy this looks. And I think it looks so good with my most worn bracelet, which is my Bulgari Serpenti Viper Cuff Bracelet. I don't even know what this is called, but I just think it has like similar vibes. So you can see this is yellow gold. This is yellow gold. The Clash de Cartier small is technically rose gold. I just think they go so well together. Like it has the same kind of notched little vibe. I mean, this is like a little tambourine. I have to do a whole separate review, but I just have to share this with you. It's so cool. Love the look. Love my new stack with my Clash de Cartier bracelet, my necklace, and my little Just en Clue little huggy. Now, part of the reason that I got the Clash de Cartier set, the bracelet and the necklace, was I knew that there was going to be a price increase. I guess I got this in April of this year, and I know it's September, and I just haven't shared it with you, but there was a huge, huge price increase at Cartier because I'm looking at the price now and oh my gosh, I'm so glad I got this because right now, and again, I'll, I have to look and I'll let you know what I paid for this, but I got this before the price increase. When I got this, I think this was around 5,000, which was like, I was like, okay, that's, that's a big chunk of change. But this retails now for 7 thousand six hundred fifty. Okay. It is so much. Now the price has just skyrocketed. Same thing with the necklace. I paid around like low, very low 2000s and it retails now for 2670. It's something that I knew I would eventually be getting. I just love that look. Oh, so cool. And I'm so glad that I got it and I saved over 2000 by getting it before the price went up. So if you're thinking about it, you know, the price is only going to go up on these items. It's something that I knew I'd wear. It's something that I know I will keep and pass on. So I'm glad I got it before the price increase. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed my recent luxury haul featuring an assortment of accessories, beauty, fragrance, bags, shoes, jewelry, and tech. I definitely will be following up with a separate review on the Cartier bracelets and comparing them and the sizes and the exact prices, but I am I'm glad I picked this up before the, the price increase. I don't know when the next one is, but if you're on the fence and you are pretty sure you're going to get it, just go ahead and get it before the price goes up. Thank you so much, Charles and Keith, for sponsoring this video. Again, you can use my code CKAHM15 to save 15% off your next order. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye.